So we have to be tough. We have to be vigilant. We have to be strong. And I tell this story. Good. Thank you, darling. I love you, too. Look at that. It's great. But I tell this story, and in a way, it's a rough, rough story. But this country is so politically correct. We don't get anything. We don't understand anything. We don't understand what's going on. We don't understand. And it's the story of General Pershing. Do you know that story? Does anybody know it? It's a rough story. And they were having a tremendous, this is before the First World War, they were having a tremendous problem with really radical Islamic terrorism. They were having an unbelievable problem. General Pershing was a tough, ruthless general. He wouldn't do well today because he was too tough, he was too ruthless, and probably used foul language. So he'd be out. They wouldn't even allow him. So this was a problem that was really out of control, many people being killed, and it was. I mean, we have a president that doesn't want to use the term. And by the way, Muslims, great people, tremendous people. We're all great people. But we understand where there's a problem. You have to bring up the name. It's called radical Islamic terrorism. I have many Muslim friends. I have many Muslim friends that call me and they say, thank you, Donald, we all want to cure it, but you can't cure a problem if you don't want to mention what that problem is. So for whatever reason, so General Pershing is having, was sent there to solve a really serious terror problem. They caught 50 radical Islamic terrorists. They caught them. They took the 50, they lined them up. They took a pig, and then they took a second pig, and they cut the pig open, and they took the bullets from the rifles, and they dumped the bullets into the pigs, and they swashed it around, and then they took the bullets, and they shot 49 of the 50 people. And the 50th person, they said, take this bullet, and bring it back to all of the people causing the problem and tell them what happened tonight. He took the bullet, he brought it back, that 50th person, and for 42 years, they didn't have a problem with radical Islamic terrorism, folks, okay? Believe me.